Hello and welcome to Irish Football Fan TV. We're here after uh, Dundalk after beating Shamrock Rovers 2-1. We're here with the record breaker, all-time leading goal scorer. How does it feel? I remember I uh, came up here last year, um, it was just before the break, and we were talking about you. You know, actually, will you will you get to that stage? And here we are now, um, not even at that stage at this part of the season, and you're after breaking. How are you feeling? And obviously, your thoughts on the game tonight? Um, you know, it's you know it's an absolute honour to break a record um, at such a big club like Dundalk. Um, you know, uh, Vinny was saying in the in the change room there that there's been unbelievable players that's played for the club throughout the years and. To break the record in in only three and a half years, you know, it's a very proud moment um, for me and my family as well. And um, you know, it's dream come true stuff. You know, my first game here was my first goal here for Dundalk was six years ago, and uh, against the old enemy Cork. <laughs> against Cork, yeah, and um, to go on and beat the record six years from now is, is you know, it's it's fantastic. And, um, and it's even more impressive the fact that you've actually been away and came back. And it's six years yeah. to the day today. Like. Yeah, I, do, I don't know the stats. I was told I've done it in, um, under half the games as well. So, you know, I'm, I'm really pleased. And, um, you know, you can't do that without great squad, great players around you who are creating your chances. And, um, you know, it's you know just over the moon, to be honest with you. Absolutely. And uh, you took your goal very well. In in our case, as fans, it's a very classic goal by you. Um, but just so, like overall, in terms of your performance tonight, uh, how did you think you did? I thought you done quite well holding up the ball and putting yeah, like, the players into play. Yeah, I thought you know I've probably played better in other games, but I thought I've done very well tonight. Um, I led the line quite well, and um, you know um, I was getting those up the pitch. I felt and. Um, you know, I thought we were, everyone was excellent tonight, especially after the first 20 minutes. I thought we fully deserved. Um, I thought we fully deserved the win. To be honest with you, it could have been a lot more. It could have been three or four, maybe five. Um, we were unlucky to concede as well. And uh, Sorry. but uh, you know, we're fully worthy of the three points. And you know, we, we have to move on very quick now because we have a massive game against Waterford on Monday. Absolutely, and you know all the talk of uh, you know uh, Shamrock Rovers kind of running away with it now. They were missing players tonight. You've been missing players and stuff like that. Now the title race is well and truly on. Yeah, um, and we knew that was a massive game tonight. We knew we had to go and get three points against them tonight, and uh, you know it, it squeezes the gap now to four points. But we have a game in hand, and um, you know it's like I said, it's a lo it's, it's a long season ahead as well. Um, there'll be a lot of chopping and changes as well. So um, you know I'm just happy that we're. We're back in it because you know after we lost to Sligo, it was a bit doom and gloom there. But we all rallied together and and we and we just responded very well. And that's down to the backroom staff. You know I thought Vinny and um, Vinny's been excellent um, and John Gill and and Higgy and just the whole backroom staff. And we just got it going at the right time. And you can see that on the pitch tonight. Yeah, you seem to thrive on these Friday Monday games. The games coming quicker. It seems to get yourself personally back into better form. Do you think that? I I fully agree on that. Yeah, I, um, as much as I don't like it towards the end because it starts getting, you, it's like you feel like you're playing at eighty percent. But you know, for the first week or two, I feel myself getting sharper. I feel myself getting fitter, and um, you know, I can f feel that in my body, and uh, you know, I'm, I'm moving a lot better, especially in the last three weeks. So you know. I actually don't mind the busy schedule, even though everyone's giving out about it, but it's where you can pick up points quick and fast, and you can see that now there's only four points in between us and Shank Rovers. Absolutely. Well, good luck on Thanks Monday, so and I'm absolutely delighted Pleasure. for you. Well done. Congratulations. <laughs>